We saw on an Instagram reel from a guy I dated once. Oh, <laughs> do we keep that? <laughs> I don't know. How do you think you want the vlog to be? <laughs> um, so we, oh my gosh, I look rough. <laughs> I just got off work. But um, basically, Leica sent me a reel and they changed their menu seasonally here. And it's in this like little cozy house um, on. What is this, Midtown? Midtown area. And everything looks so good. I'll show you guys. The names are so funny. Don't worry, Brie Happy Pizza Bees Nuts. I love all the puns. So cute. Also, before this, I stepped into a puddle. Right by the curb. Uh, my entire foot is wet through the socks. There's actually a puddle in my shoe right now. That's kind of gross. Speak. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's okay. But I probably should look before I walk. Um, that's how I looked on black eyes last time. Don't slip on black eyes, kids. <laughs> Okay, Lake I got the cosmic sour and it's so pretty. It looks literally like a pair of wings on your drink. It looks so good. Like a what? Like a pair of wings. You see how it's like yeah. hard? Angel wings. Yeah. Angel wings. <laughs> Drop it. Oh, it's good. This lighting is beautiful. It's so good. Really? Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Is it like fruity and sweet? It's like citrusy. Ooh. Okay, okay. A bunch of olives, but this bowl's a little unstable, but <laughs> this is the trash pile I created from knocking drink. it over. I got the pear and whatnot drink, also with angel wings, so let's try it out. <laughs> also very orangey. It tastes like orange more than pear. I don't know if I taste the pear, but it's also good. But I think I like yours the most. Some sweet tots and it looks so good. It's a bad angle. But... I love this so much. It's so good. It's like sweet potatoes. And I love potatoes. Oh my gosh. So good. Carrot karate. Karate kid. Karate kid. I think it's kar like karate kid. Oh, a pun. Yeah. Karate kid. Okay. Reminds me of Flower Child. It's really good. It's so soft and flavorful. It looks so good though. I'm excited to try it. Using it with my avocado. Here is the lamb. Toast punch pie. Apparently, there's chocolate inside. Yes, go ahead. Is there chocolate inside? There, it's a very thin layer of chocolate. Mm -hmm. Thank you. How is it? Very good. Okay, let me try it. This is a big one. I don't know if I taste the chocolate. Oh, I taste it now. The bitterness. It is good though. It does taste like dark chocolate. It reminds me of like s'mores. It's a rainy day this week, so we're stuck at home. But let me show you guys. I thought I should start showing all the PR packages that I received. Um from these brands because I think they're just so sweet for sending me these and they really didn't have to but for this one I received a package from Solo Vegan which is a Korean sustainable um, skincare company which I thought was really cool 
He sent me a whole variety pack of blemish spot treatments. So if you see those like stickers, or pimple patches going around. Um, these are great. I love them so much. So I can't wait to try this brand specifically. Um, it looks like they have different versions of the pimple patches as well and they have a cute little card in here a little handwritten note which is so sweet and this huge sticker pack which are filled with super cute stickers i love these and we also have here a oil control cleanser with tea tree extract which i have loved on my skin before helps with breakouts so can't wait to try this out serum and moisturizer and the packaging is so cute i love the pastels i'm such a pastel girly thank you so much to solo vegan and megan from solo vegan for sending this and i can't wait to try it out i also uh am working on a tiktok that i filmed for this but bumble and bumble sent me this dry shampoo mist and it's mainly for like post-workout or like dirty hair like day two hair and i tried it out post-workout on day two hair i did notice it was really easy to use you pretty much just shake up the powder and the liquid and you spray it on and then you just brush it or you wait 30 seconds and then you brush it out with your fingers or a brush the thing i noticed the most is that it makes your hair smell really really good so you know it's a good post-workout spray for sure my hair does look more lively and voluminous but it's very subtle so i can't really tell if it's from the mist but i do think that it does make my sweaty hair smell better for sure so that's my thoughts on it and then this one isn't pr i bought this one actually from amazon but i really needed a hand cream because lately it's been so cold here um and my hands are super dry and ashy and i don't know if you can tell on camera but sometimes they're so ashy that they crack and bleed which is crazy because i've never experienced that ever before so i decided to hop on um and a lot of reviews say this hand cream is amazing by tony moly um look what happens when it came in the package i i don't know what happened here but uh, peach is like my favorite fruit ever so i thought it was super cute and it comes in this little packaging and i i just can't wait to use it i i don't know if i can open it with one hand to show you guys but you basically twist open it and um oh i think i got it it's so cute i just can't wait to use this if i could just get it open but yeah it's so cute and just when i got this the weather's starting to warm up here but <laughs> i think it's really useful and it's so compact i can just like slip it into my purse um and i'll let you guys know how i feel about like the product itself when i use it wait you guys i just open it up and it, it smells literally just like a peach i love it so much oh my gosh but i do kind of wish that there was more in the container i don't know we'll see maybe it is enough but mm, it smells so good like <laughs> it makes me want to eat it Actually, for you, you might just someday, so I'm gonna touch it out. <laughs> really like this blue one. Actually, I don't know if there's a sitting room. Mm -hmm. We have so much here. Some beef happening behind me, I don't know what's happening. This one's cute too. Uh, I'm not hungry, huh? 
Hả? Ấu mà hồng đó cũng đẹp Cái này là loại bận dài nè xin đi Còn cái này là loại bận ngắn nè Nó muốn bận ngắn không? Mấy trẻ nó bận ngắn nha. Cái này có mấy người lớn nè Và thòn nữa nè Cái này là bận dài Phủ đắt luôn á Thi thử à... Nhưng mà xin này cao Thì ngay chắc cái kia cũng ngã Cái khám ra không có thật Anh làm tấm móc đi Cái này đẹp rồi I don't know which one to choose guys This is so hard Quê. không có thấy quê cái này mới là không có quê còn mấy cái bông bông kia hồi nãy là bông không có đẹp màu không cũng đẹp nữa nha không cần phải bông qua thiêu thùa gì trơn trọng chịu này không ờ à, xong có thích màu fusion ồ cái này có quần luôn hả áo dài đó nhưng mà sao không có thích màu đỏ trời đất xinh món cái loại ngò rồi. I'm changing it in this makeshift fitting room. Thấy màu này đẹp nhất trong mấy cái đó. Cái này thấy được. Cái này sẽ quen. Mấy cái bông này nè. Lưu 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 So, hopefully we can find some white pants for it, or like orange or peach. This shop is so cool though, they have all the aoyais hanging out too. Everyone's kind of like packing sardines in here, but I think we're gonna go with this one. I don't think I'm gonna try the other ones actually. I think we're pretty set on this peach one, it's so cute and unique too. The last one. JK decided to try the red one. Oh, can I go? Wow, look. I love the sleeves, the puff sleeves. Dạ, cái này mang gút vô là nè chăng Chị, I don't really like this one With the pants It's a size large though I just wanted to show you guys the fits in like normal lighting And yeah, the, so I don't know if you guys heard earlier But the pants were a size large So it slips down if I let go of it Which is why I'm holding on to my pants right now I think on the day of like Lunar New Year's I'm gonna have to find like a clothespin To um, just like pin the back of my pants up Because I kind of look too lazy to get it altered This whole fit is so cute And it's like peach colored which is super super unique and modern which is what i was going for there were a lot of different like colors like a lot of reds if you ever want to go like traditional but highly recommend checking out that shop it's like near the food court of like the hong kong city mall in bel air if you guys do need an aoyai for lunar new year still they still have a lot that store was super packed and it was Honestly an interesting experience trying to change in front of like all those people in that tiny little crowded shop I really love the details up here these like pearl Detailing on the collar and it goes all the way around on the back too It's kind of like a loose fit which I noticed in the modern aoyais they have a looser fit Sleeves are really like nice and it's not super long but it's not super short either We're gonna hit the temple this year which is my first time it's on my bucket list, to, bucket list to always visit the temple on Lunar New Year's and this year I finally have a chance to um, and then I also have an aoyai for the first time so I am ready to go and yeah just excited to show you guys the fit I'm probably gonna wear heels with this so it'll be looking like this because right now the pants are kind of like very very long but yeah